Hey guys, welcome back to this week's video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a journal. So by the end of this video, you'll be able to create a journal that you can use for yourself or even uh, use it uh, to sell on Amazon KDP or on Etsy or any other online platform that you use so you can earn some extra income. If you're new here, my name is Steve from stevingency.com. I create videos every week so I can help you learn something new, something that you can use uh, to earn extra income or even help uh, people around you. Um, so that's the aim of these tutorials. If you uh, haven't subscribed yet, please uh, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so that you can get notified every time I post a new video. Without further ado, let's get into it. I'll go into my screen capture right now. I'll see you right there. Okay guys, as you can see, I'm on the homepage of Canva. So all you need to do is to sign up. Uh, if you don't have an account yet, you can sign up for free. Uh, it's a free account. Uh, just go to canva.com and then sign up and you will end up on this page. So, uh, and this is a free account that you can use. Uh, I'm using my pro account here. So if you want to try a pro account, Canva Pro, uh, that will give you access to everything, all different types of uh, templates and all this stuff. Uh, so you can uh, do that for free. I'll leave the link down in the description box so that you can uh, try uh, Canva for 30 days for free and see how you go. I hope you like it. And if not, you can still uh, continue to use your uh, free account. All right, let's get into it. Uh, so what I'm going to do now, we need to create a template that we will work on to uh, designing that uh, um the journal so there are three different ways that you can uh create a journal uh, i'll try and uh, be quick to, so i can show you all of them so the first thing you need to do you go to create design up on the top right there i uh, create a design and onto that search bar just type us letter um, it should come up uh, us letter there it's 8.5 by 11 inches so this is the um uh, the size of, uh, of a journal, uh, the common size of a journal. So we'll click onto that and then it should open up uh, a blank uh, canvas. And then on the left side of the canvas, on the, uh, the left part here, you'll see different types of uh, templates. And there's a search bar up there and there's a toolbar so that we can use here to edit or to customize our, our, our journal. So, you have to click onto your uh, canvas there and then um, go onto the search bar. So what we will do first, the first thing that we'll do, we'll just um, uh, just type a uh, journal. Uh, a journal, we can just type a journal or lined paper. Actually, let's type a lined paper first, lined paper. Um, then uh, that will bring um, different types of uh, lines that you can use. You can choose from these uh, different uh, lines as you can see to create your own journal then you can customize it as well so let's see which one uh, will be the easier one to use the different forms and uh, so i'll go up as so one up there just so up to you what you like because you can still customize it as well um, i'll take this one just click on it then it should come on to the um, uh, the canvas as you can see there um, you can even uh, increase or just um, just audit as you uh, as you want it or um uh, edit as you want it uh as you can see it's got all the lines so these are the main ones so the lines you can uh if let's say you want to change any of the lines here or all the lines you want to make them a bit uh, thicker or darker you can they are gray color at the minute so you can come up here you see the gray color is uh, highlighted there so you can click on that and then maybe change and make it black as you can see it changes to black you can even uh, change the the size or the weight of the uh, of, of the line that you want and to create how you want it so this is the, the simplest way i think uh, to make it and then you can even customize uh, depending on what you want here um let's just say we're doing um um mindset journal and then you can change the font how you like it uh the font will come out you click on the font there then they'll all come up here um, whatever you want it will come um uh, let's see which one we can use yeah i think that one's fine you can even uh, uh, um, okay uh, we can use that one because you can see so that's how you do it you uh, you know you, you just um uh customize how you want it and then here you can even add your logo your logo or whatever you like what you do if you want to add a new logo uh, you come to elements and then on the elements then you type um, any logo that you want let's say maybe you want a flower um, 
and then all the flowers will come up here uh, so what you can do if you want a photo you can click to photo all the flowers that are in a photo form will come then if you come here they're all graphics and the animation the videos and then the studio there as well so you can go to graphics and then bring uh, something that you like here uh, we'll just um, um, take one of these and then I'll just do that and I'll bring it somewhere here I'll take uh, this one out and then I'll just um, there you can increase it how you want it this you see and that's it then you can what you do after you finish with this then you um, you duplicate it as to how many pages you, you want and then uh, that creates your channel so the next thing that I'm going to show you, I'll just open another page here and into uh, canvas the next one that we are going to use because we were using um, uh, lined uh, lined paper but yeah then we're going to use just journal uh, this is actually the easiest way so if you go to journal uh, you see they will have all the journals that are, are already done uh, so all you need some uh, if you see here I hover over it so it says uh, four or five of 12 pages so it's already got many pages so it's up to you whether you want to um, if you're studying a new um, canvas you can put all of them if you want uh, so that's the other easy way that you can do um, let's see this one so you can this is a general how to write an essay. Uh, we, we can just go back. Uh, let's try, I think this one, yeah. Uh, it's got so many pages, so you can select which page you want. So I'll just put the first page, then I, I'll show you. So this is an easier way, and the next thing to do as well is to customize and then put something that you want to make it your own uh, so that you can then uh, use it for yourself, for your family, or even um, um, put it onto Amazon KDP or Etsy or a creative market where you can sell it for uh, a few dollars. So that's how you do it. Um, then um, the next one, I'm going to show you the uh, the next um, a way of uh, creating a journal. This will take a little bit longer because this one is like manual. <laughs> so all you, you need to do, um, so I'll just, I'll just change the color to white. And then um, all you need to do is on your keyboard, uh, you, if you type L, um, not type, if you press L, hit L on your keyboard, and then the line will come up. So then you can then bring your, your line where you want uh, your um, general lines to start. And then what you do, uh, you come up here onto the top hand, uh, top right hand corner, and then uh, where it says duplicate, you can uh, do that and duplicate uh, to how many lines you want. Um, to to be on your on your channel uh, then you just need to arrange them bring them uh, this one as I was saying this one is a little bit slower uh, and um, but that's how uh, you you do the manual way or um, I'll just show you after you do this um, what you can do this will you can then highlight all of them like that and then you come up to a position there and then if you come to a tidy up uh, this should help you align them in the right uh, place as you can see they all align now so then you can also do the same and uh, change the the color of the, the lines make them gray uh, if you don't like the gray you can come up here and then make it a little bit not a dark gray yeah lighter gray i say and then that's it and uh, you can like you can put as many lines as you want as uh, maybe the same size as uh, the ones above so that's how you do this is the third way of doing uh, or making uh, your journal the third way of creating a journal um, by just uh, doing it manually and then you can add some elements onto it uh, what you want um, on on your journal you know that will make it your own i'll just uh, let's see what we've got for the uh, graphics, let's see the graphics for the dogs and see which one we can put in. Um, um, yeah, you know, you can design it how you want it and then um, you can put it inside in the middle and then put this picture behind the lines or you can just uh, uh, bring it here. I'll just uh, flip it to the other side. Uh, yeah, 
So you can play around with it and then see how you, you, you make it and you'll come up with something uh, that will be very, very nice and uh, hopefully you can earn some extra income with that. So that's how you can do this, guys. And uh, I hope you've got uh, um, some information that you can use. And uh, in the next video that I will make uh, will probably be how to create a cover for your journal. So let's say you've made this journal and now you want to create a... Um, uh, you want to create a, a cover so that you know obviously you need a cover for it if you're going to sell it on amazon kdp and uh, you create a nice uh, journal so that will be the next video uh, otherwise guys you can watch this uh, coming videos that i have done you know, previously they are very good they've uh, have had a lot of attention so you can maybe learn something from them as well i hope you've enjoyed this uh, video guys thank you so much for tuning in. see you in the next one there you have it guys, that's how you can create a journal for yourself, a journal that you can even use to uh, earn some extra income by selling it on Amazon KDP or on Etsy or even on uh, creative markets that uh, you know you, you know around there. So you'll be able to make some extra income. I hope you've enjoyed this video guys and if you have please uh, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so that you can get notified every time I post a new video. I hope to see you in the next one, you take care guys.